sit back, get some popcorn, because I've got some tea. Do we still say that? I do. I'm Rob Schooner from the Naughty But Nice podcast. Scandal and vice, or sugar and spice. It's naughty but nice with Rob. The top story of the day is Demi Lovato reveals she's no longer friends with Selena Gomez or even the Jonas Brothers. So in a new interview with Harper's Bazaar magazine that hits newsstands on Friday, yes, we got an advance. Demi is not holding back. So Demi is explaining that following her big comeback performance at the Grammys, who can forget it? She was fabulous. It was her first performance since her near fatal overdose. Selena Gomez took to social media writing, quote, I wish there were words to describe how beautiful inspirational and capital deserved this moment was Demi, I'm so happy for you, Uh, thank you for your courage and bravery Uh, however, now Demi is responding and it's not the response you might think, Demi responded quote, when you grow up with someone, you're always going to have love for them but I'm not friends with her, so the Instagram post felt dot 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 I will always have love for her, Selena, and I wish everyone nothing but the best. So Demi did this interview a very long time ago, and my sources tell me nothing has changed in those three months between Demi and Selena. What really happened here is that Demi felt, instead of putting something on social media, she wishes Selena had reached out and called her. Demi felt the post was actually more about showing fans and the world that Selena was a good friend. She wanted the public to think she was a good friend rather than helping Demi. Now, my Selena sources tell me Selena was absolutely blindsided by these new comments. She did not know they were coming. Nobody from the magazine gave her a heads up. She absolutely was blindsided. So Selena isn't really sure now what to do. She's debating whether or not she should respond to these comments. Also, in this massive tell-all interview, Demi's revealing that she's no longer in touch with the Jonas Brothers. In fact, the only one from the Disney era that she's still friends with is Miley Cyrus. So, what happened to these two former child stars? Do you think Selena should respond yes or no? Go to our Twitter page at Naughty Nice Rob and vote or go to our Facebook page or maybe both. It's Naughty But Nice with Rob. I do this gossip every day on my podcast, Naughty But Nice with Rob. Check it out.